Hey, 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 Big Dave, the Middle-Aged Gamer here with another episode of Cult of the Lamb. <laughs> Let's see how our little fella's doing here. Oh, got away today. Okay. People are praying. People are working. Everyone is managing. Okay, that helps a bit. Let's inspire this group. Alright, much, much better. I can deal with... Oh! Did you? Excellent. Checking something real quick. I didn't think so. But we are close to another old crown. And this thing is all nice and full. Oh, we're close. Next fill up, we should be good to go. We got some, we got some fishy offerings. Good. Place is nice and clean. I like that. Everybody, oh, oh, what's up? Pardon me, leader. I would love some of the flowers from Darkwood Dungeon if you could collect some. Sure, I can get a Darkwood. You know what? Let me do that right away. I'm doing on fundage. Nine coins? Yeah, not enough. So I guess we're going to Darkwood in today's episode. Let's see what our tarot cards are. We got Fervor's Harvest. Enemies will drop double the Fervor. Shield of Faith Plus, when attacked, 20% chance of negating damage. Oh, hell yeah. Disease Heart damages everything on screen when hit. And Gift from Below, 10% chance of getting a blue heart when killing an enemy. Oh, I like that. Our curse is Divine Blizzard, knocks back and freezes enemies. And Necromantic Axe 7, when slaying a foe, a chance to summon a ghost that will attack nearby enemies. Yes. Oh. Well, that was embarrassing. Hit the wrong button. This is going to slow me down on the editing process. Oh, well. We get Sithy's tongue. Spawn bombs across the room. Fragile. So we have a new toy. Atiar has reached old age. Respect your elders trait. Good, a couple of blue hearts. And we already got the flowers we need. Nice. Well, good to know we don't have to plan our trip for that. that freaky thing. Oh 
Okay. Moving on. Oh, Kemok! Aha! Kemok can make relic from anything. Hairs and nails, little lamb tails. Toe of the Ice Core! Freezes all active enemies. Charge speed active. Yes! Do you like my crown made by Kemak out of what? <laughs> yes, I prefer that over a fragile thing. Continue. Ah, oh, stupid traps. Man, those damn traps, jeez. Alright, continuing on. Alright, we're doing through this area. We got a stone wall! A dark wood decoration. Okay. So let's look at the plans we got here. Okay. If we want to avoid as much combat as possible, or at least needless combat, there are some ways to do this. Okay. That's Kemok. We figured that one out. This is a food vendor, looks like. We don't necessarily need that. I would like to get as many cultists as possible, so taking this route might be the way to go. Or okay, it's not like we need the stone. Hmm. And as I said, I'd like to avoid any needless combat if possible. I mean, getting a... Okay, that is the cat um, merchant who has... Oh, crap. They were in the last video. They sold... Oh, they had some stuff and you can get a uh, tarot card from them too but a food vendor and then getting some more food as well <clears throat> I don't know I've never seen a food vendor before so I'm kind of tempted to roll this way oh why the hell not live and learn right Aw, okay, they're cute. Rakshasa. Oh, we've met Rakshasa before. Fresh, fresh, fresh. You won't find better. So, we can get 15 berries, 8 salmons, or 5 berry bush seeds. We're going to go with the salmons. Delicious. Enjoy, traveler. Oh, sorry. Don't you dare touch my lo- Oh, I wasn't trying to. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm kind of a dick. What can I say? <laughs> Alright, what do we got here? Berry bushes! You pick them, you don't hack them. Whoops. I guess I really didn't need to go this way. We're actually in pretty decent shape on food, but had to satisfy my curiosity. Oh well, we're still gonna get a cultist out of the boss, so not the end of the world. And I guess technically it's less fighting.
And looks like our uh, furry freezy foot is good to go again. Yeah, there's two ways we can go here. Let's go this way. Well, by going the wrong way, I've gone the right way, if you get what I mean there. Gotta use heavy attacks to get rid of those shields. Alright, so we're gonna hack things up first before we look to upgrade. Okay, what do we got? A Necromantic Sword 8. A little faster, but a lot less damage. No. Or the point of corruption eight, an explosive projectile. Hold to aim. Well, considering I have a freeze everything, that might actually be more useful. I think we'll go with that. Wow, that was well-timed. Witness Agoras. Oh, jeez, if I'd known that was going to happen, I would have saved this. You out of here. Okay, a skull necklace, more lumber, or berry bush seeds. Uh, let's go with the skull necklace. I have the witness. I have no idea what the eye of the witness does, but. I have it. All right. One thing about this fight, man, we got a lot of bones out of this. Uh, 
All right, well, we survived, and that's all that matters. Crusade onward. Now you have defeated the bishop of this area, you may continue onward. Greater rewards await the further you venture. But beware, if you don't have the Omnipresence Crown ability, you will not be able to return to the cult until you reach another teleporter. Only continue onwards if you are prepared to leave your cult for a little while longer. Right. Well, we're not. We gotta go back. We have things to do, we're really banged up, and we don't have that ability. 53 bones, very nice. So we did good on that one. Okay, it is time. We are going to re-educate our little friend here. And he's still not having it. <clears throat> Let's collect what we got. <clears throat> Let's get our inspiration. Yeah, it didn't really need the propaganda speakers. We do need to upgrade. We do need that healing bay. We'll have to find a place to put one just in case we get somebody sick. Okay. Alright, everything seems clean. People are not quite happy, but we will talk to. You honor me, great leader. I am eternally grateful. Quest complete, everybody's ha a little happier. Let's get a new friend in. Witness Edgaris. We will keep your name. We will keep your form. You have the strong constitution trait. Heal 15% faster when sick or in bed rest. Or in coprophiliac. Gain 10 faith when falling ill. Okay. Well, let's get you chopping some. Oh, we need to make some. We need to make a bed. First and foremost. Oh, no. Oh. We need to make a bed. Duh. We're gonna put it there. <clears throat> Let everybody do their thing. Once that's done, we're gonna do our sermon. And then we are going to ascend uh, ITR. Now we need to upgrade our bed. Our little grumpy one still has one more day left of being grumpy, and then he will be released from timeout. Yeah, I said it. Alright, we need more gold. Actually, first we need to build a medical bay, a healing bay. What are we missing? Consecrated wood. What do we have here? We have consecrated wood. Would you look at that? Did we ever build that janitor? Wait, hold on. Did we ever build that janitor station? Aww. A couple of cultists have become friends. We have not built a janitor station yet. We desperately need to. And we're still missing consecrated bars. All right. Let's consecrate our gold into bars. And while that does hinder anything we need to build, we can still sell stuff. Okay, we're going to sell some berries. We don't exactly need all these better. Actually, we're going to wait off. I'm getting myself distracted. First things first. First things first, we got to upgrade the crown.
All right, so we're looking at Law and Order. Or none above the law. Belief in original sin trait. Trade unlock. All are born guilty. Reduce faith loss from putting a follower in jail who is not dissenting. Oh, that might have been what happened there. Or belief in absolution. Freedom above all else. Every day that begins without anyone in prison, gain 10 faith. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna put the reduced faith loss because we've already been burned by that for and there will be a need to put people in prison. Right. And now for a ritual, it's time. As much as I would love to resurrect, we don't have the fundage to do both resurrect and ascend. We need to ascend. It's time for Altyar to make his way upward. Oh, we got some levels out of that one. And we got a much happier flock. Well, well worth it. We lost the cultists. But this was well, well worth it. Alright. Find our levelers. You have leveled. You have leveled. Actually, no. Skull necklaces, improve life expectancy. Yes! It's time to start handing out necklaces, let's be honest here. Oh! Leader, my brother and I were traveling through together through Darkwood and were separated. I never knew what became of him. Do you think you could find out? Yeah, totally! Feather necklace. Increases loyalty, increased movement speed. Actually, hold up. Sounds to me like a feather necklace should go here. Oh, nice. Okay, looks like this is going to be the last day of the Ritual of the Fast, so... Get them spiders. Alright, let's look at our Consecrated Resources. Okay, we never did bother selling. Wait a minute. 
Hey, a stone block. Excellent. Okay, we got stuff we can sell. Okay, we're going to start by selling off some berries. Okay, 25. We need to consecrate more gold. And we need to consecrate some wood. Could not have planned that any better. Because we still need to build this janitor station. And we need the consecrated wood to build this healing bay here. And eventually put together a summoning circle. But there is a priority here. The janitor station and the healing bay must come first. Everything is clean. I guess the outhouses aren't used much if you're not eating. Okay, we need to sell more stuff. Let's sell some stone. That's actually not what I meant to do, but okay. What I actually meant to do... Okay, I need to talk to this fellow here. Okay, so what we need to do is go back into the temple. Wait a minute. Order of operations, Dave. Re-educate. Okay, now we're going to release. And we're going to give a gift. Okay, now we're going to give a sermon. Oh, we're close to a spot here. Man, how long's the cool that on this? Ah, we still got a bit. Rituals for resurrection. Yeah, we're gonna need more bones for that. Really, not much else I want to do. Okay. We're gonna need to go back out there to back to Darkwood again and find our cult that cultist brother. Oh, that's the janitor station. We already have one. Oh. Hell yeah. Let's just make a healing bay. Alright. 
You already have. Good. You do not have a necklace. Let's give you a necklace. Barbatos is ready for a level, but... Barbatos, you need a necklace, my friend! Let's give you a feather necklace. Should put everybody in a pretty good spot. Oh, we're maxed out. Okay, these guys are not messing around with this, are they? And oh, not quite enough for another one yet. All right, we're gonna go crusade. We are in a good spot here. Back to Darkwood. Oh wait, no, we can't never did make that food. So we need to make ten things of food to satisfy our friends. Alright. Okay, so we can make one modest mixed meal with no detriments. So yeah, we'll do that. Then we need to make six of something else. Six grassy rules, that's fine. Let them all feast. Now we can go off. No, oh, wait, we want to stick around and see if they drop any resources. Uh oh. Somebody got a little nauseous. Oh well. If that's all we got, that's all we got, but that could have been worse. Oh, four meats. That could have been useful. And they're done with the Consecration. And we have everything built that we need. So, we're in good shape. Never thought I'd say that. Wait, we need 22. That's enough. That'll get us our level. Let's get some inspiration, huh? Alright, what do we want? Do we want the Crypt? Lay multiple dead followers to rest, avoids rotting corpses. Maybe. Or not. The Harvest Totem. Increase the growth speed of all farm plots within range. The upgraded farmer station is what I'm going to want. We are queued up for that. But we do need to just start putting things up that will prep for further things. Mm. Or do we just want to go cult three? Upgraded Demonic Summoning Circle. Summon two demons at a time. I don't know. 
You know what? We're just going to start grabbing things to for further upgrades. Let's upgrade the summoning circle. We are going to need to build that anyway, so... Yeah, might as well. What are we missing? Stone blocks. So we need to consecrate some stone. So go ahead and do that while I do my thing. So we're going back to Darkwood again. I guess we're skipping Anura today. That's fine. Let's look at our tarot cards. Divine Strength. Attack rate increased by time and a quarter. Good for those slow weapons. The Hearts 1 gain an extra half a heart. Okay, the Lover's 1 plus 1. Spirit Heart. Okay. And Ambrosia increases curse attack damage by time and a quarter. Nice. Alright, let's see what we got. Our curse is Touch of Turua 7. Kind of invoke a violent eruption of powerful tentacles. Loved Karath would be so proud. And the Bane at 7. Poison. It's hard, slow as hell. But the time in the quarter will help. Soul of the Bones. It would be nice to get a resurrection going. Continue. You know the extra the extra attack rate is really helping. Oh wow! Decisions, decisions. Let's go this way. Good eyes, toenail. Summon a new curse with an increased level. Alright, there we go. Level 8. And we'll charge that up. And every time it's charged up, we will use it to increase our curse. it for this direction. Uh, let's go this way. Looks like this was the way. That has collapsed and the flock is ready for another sermon. Alright. Let's go this way then. Uh huh. Okay, that's useful. Alright, moving on.
All right, that's the end of that. Got another skull necklace. Got some health back. That's good. All right, we got everything we need there. Moving on. Okay. All right, so it looks like we need to go there. Yeah? And there. So I guess we're going this way. Spawn bombs across the room, fragile. No, we're actually not going to take it. We're just going to hack everything. Fine, fine, fine. Quit being a douche. Oh. Your possessions will follow you through death. Well, sounds to me like if we end up getting murdered, we will have our goodies back. Oh, we found the brother. Ah. We got a good curse. Got him. <sighs> so we have rescued Amity's brother. Let's do this. Oh, wow. Okay, we are hurting. We have here Cleansing Fire 11. Shoot three projectiles at once. Or the main dagger 8. It's going to be a lot faster, but the damage goes down. It's poison versus poison. I prefer the faster weapons. Besides, we're going to get the... Alright, so we got two decisions to go here. And we're not quite powered up yet. Oh! Trader's Razor 9. Same speed, har harder hit. Yeah, I just, th I think we need the better weapon. All 
Alright, we didn't get any help out of that, but we got to get a better weapon. That's going to be useful. Oh, Barbatos is back! melee attack. Okay. Oh, and I got martyred. That's alright. I got death proofed, so that's okay. And we got what we needed out of that. So all things considered, that could have been much, much, much worse. Alright, let's head back. Collect our Popcorn pellets. Indoctrinate Yaron Mir. Yes, sir. All right, Yaron Mir. Germaphobe. Cynical. And strong constitution. Let's give him a gift of. Necklace. Oh, we need more beds. Oh, we have a collapsed bed, don't we? There we go. Beds are fixed. All right, you stay up now. <laughs> Ooh, gold nuggets. We're going to consecrate those. Okay. Oh, people are getting hungry, so we're going to need to start making 11 foods now. All right. All right, there's that. And now for some grassy gruel. about the only thing I really need to do for this place is to make food. And that'll get everybody fed. Murgray has reached old age. Ugh. Alright, in two. Actually, we're going to let them eat first. But the way I have it set up, I'll never have to really worry about cleaning up after after the uh, cultists ever again. So that's good. Alright, you know what? Let's collect that Murdy's reward, get the quest done. Ooh. Gotta find that Murdy first. There he is. Oh, leader, I'm so grateful my brother is here at last. Okay. Now, let's do the daily. First, let's play with the crown. Oh, we are starting to get a flock here. Possessions. Exaltation of the self or of the devoted. Alms for the poor ritual. Perform a ritual at your temple in which you distribute money to all your followers to increase their loyalty. You will also gain ten faith. Ritual of enrichment. Perform a ritual at your temple in which all followers donate gold to you. We're going to do that. Because, uh... It's not like I'm hoarding the gold. I'm spending it or I'm consecrating it. 62 bones. Okay. Takes a bit of a hit on the faith, but well worth it. Okay. Let's do our daily sermon. Oh. 
Ring, ring goes the bell. All right, let's see what we got here. We got zealous weapons. Zealous weapons will cause collected fervor to increase your divine inspiration bar. Oh. Ooh. Curse of the Necromancer. Three new curses will appear in your crusades. Fervor of the Righteous 2. Increase total amount of fervor you can hold, allowing you to cast additional an additional curse. Maybe. Well, I'm really looking at these zealous weapons. Well, that's a good start to the next one. Alright. Let's see what rituals we can do. Oh, I'd love to ascend. I mean, that will take a bit of a hit, but not like we can't afford it. Uh, we have 109. Can't afford that. It, if I do this, I can't afford anything else except for a bonfire, but it's not like we need it. Uh, if I do this... I don't know. I don't, it's not like I desperately need that. You know what? I think we need more information before I do a ritual. So we're going to wait off on that. We got 38 gold. Okay, well, we still need to make that summoning circle. Oh, I need more consecrated stone for that one. As I was saying, oh, got to start one step at a time. Okay, there's really not much going on over here, is there? We're going to put that there. And it looks like I need to make more food. So that I will do. Hmm. Rassy Gruel for everybody! Enjoy, everybody! Let them do their thing. Oh, what do we got here? Oh, excellent. Consecrate more gold. All right, the demonic summoning circle is up. Okay. Upgrade the summoning circle. Anything else there? No faith. What have we not built? We have an offering statue. We have the tabernacle. We have not built the missionary yet. We need more gold for that. Let's see what we can sell real quick. No, keeping the bones. That okay.
Yep, tried to get one more level out of our oldster. Before they shuffle off. What do you need? Oh, a level. Alright, so we got our missionary. I'm not sure if I'm ever going to use it, but at least let's have it up there. Is there anything I haven't built yet? We have a tabernacle, we have an offering statue, it's not like they use them all that quickly. Alright, is there anything else I'm missing? Honestly, we could use another stone quarry. Yeah, we're down to only 62 stone. Alright, so we need to sell a few more things. Oh wait, the consecration's done. Yep, not enough. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Go to the ritual. Actually, no we're not. Hang on, there's a method to my madness in all of this. So. Need to build another bed. Because we're going to, albeit briefly, be up, be up to 12 cultists before we call it a day. And that thing's almost maxed. Oh, somebody... Oh, Murgray, you shouldn't have. Okay, they're still working on the upgrade, and why isn't everybody... What's going on? Things full already? Jeez. Okay. Ritual. Resurrection. Yay. We have a level... Gusion was only level 3. Tiana was only level 3. We have some level 3s. So we're going to go with Gusion. Bit of a dip on that, but that's okay. Well, well worth it. We now have a dozen followers. Look at that. Alright. Now, can we build the stone quarry? Heh! <laughs> we need to sell a couple of things to do so. Okay. Sell a couple more berries. That's it. That's all I needed. Much as I would love the extra 
it's night time we do need a builder all right so we're gonna we're gonna get some more food prepped here what's this a bowl of poop no what we got here deadly dish no a stringy meat gruel uh, I'd rather do I would honestly rather do the grassy gruel Might have to pick the berries pretty soon. Don't really need to consecrate anything, but he's building. Let's help him out. What, buddy? Excuse me, leader. Some creatures are seeking shelter with our cult, but they are sick. Should we let them join? Flock is ready for another sermon. So we got a stone quarry going. Let everybody eat. Convert me to your cult. I will follow your teachings faithfully. Okay. This is Bremerty. 15% harder to level up. I'm recruiting follower immediately gains 10 faith. I will need to make another bed and such. Okay. Oh. Hold on a sec. So what we're gonna do is All right, so we need to make more beds. We need gold, which means we're going to need to We're gonna need to sell some more crap. Okay. We've got a bunch of menticide mushrooms here. That actually did us a pretty good job there. Alright, so we need to build two beds. So we're gonna build one here, and we're gonna build one here. And yeah, as this video is about to end, man, this place is getting huge. Now to upgrade them. All right, while that's going on, we're going to get this cat going, or Fox? Cover me to your cult. I will follow your teachings faithfully. We've got strong constitution. Heals 15% faster when sick and in bed rest. And germaphobe lose 10 faith when falling ill. Alright, well they're sick and... Yeah. That's okay. And that puts everybody in a much better spot. We have got 14 whopping followers all of a sudden. Oh. Zespar. Thank you, leader. My faith in you was justified.
This place is hopping all of a sudden. And, oh my god, I'm going to need to build a third outhouse. I need more consecrated wood. All right, while well, all that silliness is going on, I think we have another day of... Oh we, oh, we got another crown to do. Okay. Where should we go with this? Let's go with afterlife. Return to the earth or preserve our earthly remains. Return to the earth. Unlocks the natural burial building. The corpses of dead followers may return to the earth by becoming fertilizer. Or grieve the fallen unlocks the grave building. Gain two faith when followers grave at the gra grieve at the grave. Blah. Fertilizer is not an issue. This one is not a choice. Keeping our faith up would be good. Yeah, this video has gotten long. Door Daily Sermon. Wow. And that'll be it there. And I think I have... Stone, chop trees, worship, refined materials. We're okay with that. That one's full, that one's full. But I think I do need to build. Dude, go bars, really? Okay. It's not like we not like we can convert what we've done, but it will be better. Okay. We still need to build that outhouse. We're still waiting on the consecrated wood. That's okay. We just needed the one. We need to build one more outhouse cuz at various and different extreme points in the place that should help. Alright, let them do their thing. Let's check out food. Okay. Okay, meager mixed meal, 10% chance of increasing follower loyalty. Let's at least get that out of the way. Mince follower me. 40% chance of stopping a follower from dissenting? What? Oh, that's crazy. Okay. All right, we're going to have to do that. Man, it gets crazy there when people get hungry. Oh, we got somebody leveled. Witness Agara. Oh. 
and wow. Okay. Just. Whoops. Oh, what is it, Edmerty? Leader, my brother Yaramir has joined us here and. I can't stand him! Our whole lives he's overshadowed me, but no more. Let us fight. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> uh, we're going to save that for the next video. That'd be a great way to start the next video. Not going to lie. And we can't... No, we need more bones for that. So... Yeah, we're going to save it for the next video, and... Oh, wow. Did they really fill that up? Eh, just about. Alright. Sorry, you are. Inadvertent. Alright. We got a new uh, inspiration. So, yeah, looks like we're going to upgrade our missionary. No. Do we really even use it? Harvest totem. No. Don't even really use that. Nothing really worth upgrade. You know what? Screw it. Cult 3. Upgrade temple and shrine. Collect more devotion and allow more followers to pray. I think that's what needs to be done here. And that's going to unlock a lot more useful things. Cult upgraded. Why did they give us bleeding eyes? Give us something new to build? Because it sure as hell don't look like it. Okay. That was a hell of a way to end this, huh? Alright, guys. Yeah, we gotta leave it here. Otherwise, this video is gonna run forever. Alright, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to get the latest and greatest videos as they come in. And to help this channel grow. This has been Big Dave the Middle-Aged Gamer. This is Cult of the Lamb, and this has been a whole hell of a lot of Cult of the Lamb. I'll see you all next time.